An Atlanta property owner is frustrated after he says people have been living on his land without permission for years. He says squatters have been living on a southeast Atlanta property since the pandemic. Fox 5's Mary Smith breaking it all down for us tonight. The owner of this nine acre property tells us he plans to build fencing around the front of the property in an effort to keep people out. It's frustrating that, that I'm having to spend so much money. I spend $10,000 on cleaning up garbage from vagrants. Atlanta native David Morris, who now lives in California, owns this nine acre property in Atlanta's Lakewood area. It's the site of his former nonprofit, Lakewood Environmental Arts Foundation. He said about 10 years ago, he started letting four people live on the property rent free if they helped care for the land. But during the COVID pandemic, he closed the nonprofit and noticed even more people staying on his property. The people who were living on the lands started having other people live on the land, they're friends. I tried to file eviction and the city of Atlanta said, sorry, we have a moratorium on evictions right now. He says now, years later, he has about eight people living on the property and was contacted by code enforcement to clean it up. Um, the last month I've gone through five dumpsters. And he says in recent months, at least one person living on the property filed a counterclaim for $190,000. That was dismissed, and, and yeah. there was no actual, that counterclaim, because they didn't show up in court. So it will take, it will take, I'm predicting another 30 days before the marshals will call me to schedule a time for me to have five people here to move everything from there to the street. I did get a writ of possession uh, on Friday. About a year ago, Atlanta police visited the area where activists said about two dozen of them were detained. The entire medical staff of Stop Cop City camped on this land, and there's about 30 campers. Mm -hmm. And the police came in and pulled them out of their tents. I'm neutral. I, yeah, yeah. I'm, not, I'm not on either side. Moore says he just wants everyone off his land so he can clean it up to build affordable housing. We're going to build a, just a big fence here and a gate here and put no trespassing signs. I'm not going to build it until all the tenants are out and, uh, you know, I start getting this place cleaned up. In Atlanta, Mary Smith, Fox 5 News.